Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Toledo, Ohio with Big Wuss Audits. And he is dead set on filming the police at an accident scene and antagonizing everybody involved behind their backs. We all know the guy's a coward. We all know the guy's an idiot. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What up, guys? Big West Audit. Today we're back here with another video. But shut up, Wesley. Do daily uploads every day at 8.30 a.m. Today is actually a, a newer kind of video, guys. It's a, it's where I see the police doing a, something, conducting their activities, and I go and record them while they're out on duty. So we're here in Toledo, Ohio, guys. You got the Sylvania Township Police out here. There was just a car accident. I, th I think you got the, the victims over there. I'm not going to put them on the camera too much. Uh, the victims are screaming at me. I don't think they're a little upset at recording. Well, of course they're upset. I suppose you've never been to an accident scene, or even been in an accident, or responded to an accident scene as a firefighter. Well, I've responded to a lot of them whenever I was a firefighter. And let me tell you something. Emotions run high. Especially for those involved in the accident. So, why don't you try adding a new word to your limited vocabulary. It's called empathy. Learn it. You should probably pay attention when you drive, bro. Don't, but shut up, Wesley. So yeah, I got this victim over here smoking a cigarette. He's uh, yelling. I kind of upset I'm recording, but I'm, I'm on a public sidewalk. So That's the guy that was just yelling about me. So this guy's over here recording. Oh, uh, big deal, bro. You should be more worried about your car. What's that? Absolutely, for the news. News purposes. There's a. This is a. There's an accident right here. Okay. It's newsworthy, ma'am. Yes, it is. A, a, a car accident is very newsworthy. Oh really? I've been to a great many accident scenes, more than I can count, probably in the hundreds, at the very least. And not once did I ever see any news reporter come along to uh, record it, to document it. Unless there was something earth-shattering about it, like a local celebrity involved in it, or anything like that. I sure as hell don't see any on this scene, and that includes you. Oh, wow. this is public, public, ma'am. If she doesn't sign a waiver, there's going to be a problem, guys. This is a public, public property. And lady, Karen, I wasn't even putting you on camera. I was recording the cops, idiot. And thus, here is one of the reasons why he is called Big Wuss. Because he's just a coward and he will not call that woman an idiot to her face. He is too much of a chicken shit.
got to sign a waiver for me to post you on YouTube. Oh no. Actually, Big Wolves, that is correct because a uh, Long Island Audit got in a confrontation with this IT guy and they had to blur out his face from the video. Otherwise, the IT guy would have filed a complaint and had the video taken down. Don't be posting any of that on Facebook. Why is that, sir? No, it's not. Can't put this, you can't put this crash on Facebook. Why not? Because it's against the law. It's not your right. You don't What's know that law? People, you don't know how these people Sir, feel. I'm allowed to film in public. This is The news do it all the time. I the work for the news. There's rules about it. I work for you the news. You can't, as an individual, just put it on the internet. And those people are being... Do you want to ask that police officer? Because I think that, I can. Go ask that lady if you can put it on Facebook. I don't have to have her permission. Well, just like with the Long Island audit incident... You can file a complaint on YouTube, and they can blur your face out if they want to keep the video up. But most of the time, frauditors are not going to tell you where the video is going, so it becomes more difficult to take the video down. I can't post a video of a car accident that happened on a public road. Yeah. That's not how the law works, sir. I don't care. I don't want on Facebook with you. You work for the public for a tow truck company. Once again, your stupidity shows through. Most, if not all, Tow truck companies are privately owned and operated. They provide a service to the public. They are not public companies. You seriously need to go out and get educated on how the world really works. You work for the public for a tow truck company. I'm not going to post it on Facebook, but I can post it wherever I want. I'm allowed to film. Tell me I can't film. You work for a tow truck company. Did you want to hear? Excuse me, officer. Officer. Can I talk to you guys one up for a second? What do you need, sir? Um. I was just here recording the accident. I have every right to do that in public, oh, they, right? They prevent you at all. Go right ahead. No, I know that. I know that, sir. But this gentleman in the tow truck approached me and said, "If I post this video on Facebook, I'm gonna get in trouble." Is okay. that true? If you want to do that, you can sue this company. I don't there want. I don't want to sue that, anybody, sir. I just want to be able to. I just want to be able to record. We're not stopping you, sir. You go right ahead. Okay. Thank you, sir. So I'm saying, if I post this video, I won't get in trouble. Hey, I have nothing to do with that. I'm not preventing you from recording. Thank you, guys. When you post or whatever medium or platform you use, we have no. Over that. Th thank you guys. I do not have the right to stop you as long as you're on public property. Thank you guys. Anything else, sir? Because I have work to do. No thanks. Thank you for your service. Oh my goodness. That seeking out of validation right there just goes to show you have a weak and fragile ego. You are not cut out for First Amendment frauding. Get a real job before you have too much of a criminal record to do anything with your life.
That's too funny, guys. This cop got in the wrong car. But shut up, Wesley. Okay. Well, sir, to, to be honest with you, it's it's your job to cover that up because you're in public, so you have to make privacy. Obviously, you roll your windows up or something, but I'm going to respect that, and I'm not going to record your computer screen or your notepad because I know that these people are probably really stressed out right now. I don't want to make anyone's job harder. I apologize, sir. Can I get your name and badge number one time? They try their best to create that privacy, but with morons like you roaming around, it certainly makes it a hell of a lot more difficult to do so okay thank you sir okay all right guys so officer perry badge number 420 said i can't record inside his police car or his on his notepad or his computer because he's got a uh, private information even though he's in a public parking lot here in rite aid that's uh cop vehicle number 26 I, I was just about to work for the news. And I Wait a second. What was that jump cut all about? Why did you do that? What was said between you and her to make you want to cut that piece out? Did it not benefit your narrative? I'm just, I'm just here to report the police, okay? What news company do you work for? Yes, I do. I, I work for my own company. But uh, out of respect for you and your family, like I said, I'm going to cut you guys out. And I apologize that I didn't want to come off rude. I'm not, I don't want to harass you guys or anything like that. I'm just here to record the police speaking. To be honest with you, ma'am, I apologize. I'm sorry, guys. Have a great day. Okay, so I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt you. I Alright guys, so I just went and apologized to that Karen. She pulled her phone out and started recording me. Had to tell her that I got no bad will or bad intention. I'm just here to record the cops, honestly. Oh boy, you're a two-faced coward, aren't you? You talk nice to them to their face, but the moment you turn your back on them, you start talking that crap about them. Ma'am, ma'am, can I just say, I'm, I'm not going to record you or anything or put your vehicle in. I apologize. I'm just really just here to, to record the police and stuff like that. I apologize, ma'am. I'm sorry. Okay. You lying little punk. You just told her you weren't going to record her vehicle. Then, what's the next thing you do? You turn around and record her vehicle. You have no honor, honesty, integrity, whatever you want to call it. Damn, this guy's just driving it right up the ramp. Last, you put it on a hook. Okay, well, the video is pretty much done, and the idiot stays around for a while. But in every video, he continues approaching the dark side of the force. He's too probably too far gone to be salvaged. I mean, the guy is a blooming moron.